Welcome to Minions Rise of Gru in one minute. First, we get a fun little shower montage. Gru is only 11, but he wants to play in the big league, so he tries to join the Vicious Six, but they reject him and he's sad about it. Taking revenge, he steals the Zodiac Stone and escapes, leaving the stone with Minion Otto, but then Otto made a big oopsie and traded the special stone for a pet rock. Gru gets mad, but then his favorite villain of all time and founder of the Vicious Six, Wild Knuckles, kidnaps him and Gru ends up weirdly being kind of mentored by his captor. Also, there's Disco, because this takes place in the 70s. Meanwhile, the Minions are freaking out without their mini boss, so they learn Kung Fu from Master Chow so they can save Gru and they make sure they practice their kung fu a lot. Like, a lot a lot. Oh right, and while Kevin Stewart and Bob lead the minions in their quest to rescue Gru, Otto goes on a solo road trip to track down the biker who stole the Zodiac Stone, and surprisingly, he actually succeeds in getting it back. Meanwhile, Gru has a great time with his new mentor and steals the Mona Lisa. Oh, and we can't forget about all the minion booties. Then there's Chinese New Year, where everyone turns into animals and the villains end up as rats, and then they get arrested. Gru, Nefario, and the minions drive away, and the end.